Greetings and welcome back to my channel Trisha Bakes. Today we're making rock buns. I'm starting off with some diced coconut which I'm going to blend and strain to make coconut milk. In my bowl, I'm starting off with 500 grams of plain flour, to which I'm adding 227 grams of butter. I'm going to use a pastry blender until my mixture resembles fine breadcrumbs. I'm using fresh nutmegs and I'm roughly going to grate her in about half a teaspoon. Next I'm adding sugars. I decided to use 100 grams of light brown sugar and 125 grams of damarera sugar. Now I'm adding two teaspoon of baking powder and one teaspoon of ground cinnamon. This is optional, but I'm adding eight tablespoons of raisins, which have previously been soaked in my rum mixture. After giving everything a good mix, I'm going to add roughly the size of a small grated coconut. I would suggest using a fresh coconut rather than the desiccated coconut as the dry version can be quite sweet. In a small jug, I've got four eggs, to which I'm going to be adding two teaspoons of vanilla flavoring. You could also use vanilla extract. And after mixing this together, I'm going to then add it slowly to the flour mixture. Here I have the coconut milk that I made at the beginning of the video. Altogether, I used eight tablespoons to achieve the desired consistency. You want your dough to be wet, kind of moist, but not too oversaturated.
I use the fork and a spoon to just place them on a parchment lined baking sheet. There is no right or wrong way of making these. The only thing you want to pay attention to is to make sure that they're all roughly the same size so that they bake evenly. This mixture was enough to make roughly 16 to 17 rock buns. I baked mine at 190 degrees Celsius for roughly 25 minutes until they came out golden brown. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe, share, comment and like. Until next time, blessings.